Hey, and welcome to Shipping Hero, the most powerful shipping app that anyone could possibly use for Shopify. This is so cool. And in this video, I myself, Adrian Morrison, am going to walk you through uh, just some a general overview of what this app does, what's included, and show you how you can access all of the powerful features of Shipping Hero. Okay, so right now, let's do a little training on the different types of items and shipping rates that we use. So there's two main product types that most people use on their stores. The main one is retail products. So these are products that are selling at a retail price. And then there's a lot of people that use the free plus shipping method on some of their products where they offer the product completely free but they charge them a specific shipping and handling rate. So I've already set up done for you shipping rules and for retail items on my personal store, this is what I've set up and what I've done for you already if you've installed this app. So number one is if someone domestically, that for me is in the United States of America, comes in and buys one product, we charge them $4.95 for shipping and handling, just a flat rate. If somebody comes in and buys two plus products, right, from the US, then we charge them a flat rate of $9.95. Logic behind that is it costs more money to ship two products than one product. Generally, that's how stores work, right? So if somebody comes in and buys more than one product, uh, if it's four, five, six, seven, eight products, we still just charge them that flat rate of $9.95. Now, if we have an international customer come in from, let's say, London or Australia or uh, Canada, wherever it may be, we charge them a separate international rate, and that is $9.95. Now, that means if they buy one product, they're still going to get charged $9.95 for shipping and handling. The logic behind that is international sales, shipping an item internationally generally cost a little bit more. So if someone's purchasing something internationally, then they have to pay a higher shipping rate. Now you can edit that, but that's just what I have already set up for you. Okay. And that's what I've been doing on my store for a long time. Now we also have a bonus rate that we've built in called the 100 plus dollar get free shipping rate. This means if you ever want to do a promotion on your store to entice people to spend a hundred dollars, um, if they do, they can get free shipping. So if somebody comes in and they spend 100 plus dollars on a retail items, we'll give them free shipping. Now this is optional. You can toggle this on or off. Okay. Now the second type of items that we sell on our store are free plus shipping items. So I've included some done for you shipping rules. And this is so big because people that are doing both retail and free plus shipping always run into this this crazy problem and loophole where Shopify gets confused and it screws up the shipping rates. But with Shipping Hero, you don't have to worry about that. So what we do is if someone from the US comes in and they order one of our free plus shipping products, then we have a done for you uh, rule set up where it charges that person $10.97 to cover both the shipping and the processing for that free product, okay? Now, if someone international comes in and wants to purchase a free plus shipping item, we charge them $11.97. Because they're international, we bump the shipping price up for the item a dollar. So the item is free, but they're paying $11.97 for the shipping and handling. All right, now, if anybody in the world, no matter if they're in the US or London or Australia, New Zealand, uh, Zimbabwe, no matter what, if people come in and they buy two or more free products, then we charge them $9.95 per product. Now, the logic behind that is, is if somebody comes in and they're buying multiple products, you're giving them a little discount on the shipping and handling. And Shipping Hero will automatically apply a new $9.95 rate to the, your shipping and handling cart. Uh, for every free product that somebody adds. So if they add in four products, right? Shipping Hero is going to say, okay, well, your shipping fee 
is around $40 because you have four products and it's $9.95 per product. And of course, people, if they're only getting one product, then we're charging them a little bit more of a premium because they're only buying one product. And you know, there's not a lot of profit margin in the free plus shipping items. So we really need this. And this is huge. Now, this is very hard to set up with the standard Shopify shipping and handling settings. It's Shopify is not built for it, but Shipping Hero automates all of this for you. So coming back here in our Shipping Hero app, under global rules, you'll see that we have the done for you retail and free plus shipping rules right here. And then we have the $100 free plus, uh, the free shipping rule here for you. If you ever want to run that type of promotion, you can do that just simply by clicking boom, right here on this and you're good to go. All right. Now, once this is done, it's autumn. It's literally, it is working for you immediately. Our shipping rules are working for you. So let's just jump over to our store real quick fast and let's test out some of these shipping rates okay so jumping over here to our store all right what i've done here is i've added one single uh product to our store that is a retail product it's a cat laser pointer all right and we're charging right here you can see uh four dollars and 95 cents for that product now underneath this on Shopify, you see this really cool extra option. It says insured shipping and handling. And it says get 100% insurance on your items for just a dollar extra, a dollar 95 extra. It's totally worth it. This is what's called a bump, uh, bump shipping uh, price. And what it does is it entices the customer to spend another dollar and 95 cents to basically get a guarantee from you if their item does not reach their house and the parcel uh, loses it, that you'll replace it. Now, parcels very rarely lose an item, right? So this is a very minimal risk for you. And if you have 100 customers take this a day, well, then you're going to make another $200 a day just in like pure profit because they insured their shipping. Does that make sense? I hope so. And it's great. And it's like literally pure money, pure profits. So this is a, a feature that Shipping Hero adds in. So coming back over here to the Shipping Hero app. All right. So once you get inside the app, if you come over here to settings, see up here at the top, tip, 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 top settings, let's click on that. So when you click on the settings, Shipping Hero allows you to identify a custom name for your shipping settings uh, for people that just get charged a standard shipping rate. So if we jump back over to my Shopify store, you'll see where it says standard shipping and handling. You can go and change this if you want to by going into Shipping Hero settings and just changing the name right here. That's all you have to do is just change the name from standard shipping and handling. Then if you want, you can enable what's called the bump shipping rate. All right, now bump shipping rate helps you earn more money and uh, take a very minimal risk, right? And you don't have to name it insured shipping. You could name it express shipping. You can name it secured shipping. Basically what it does is it gives you the option to make more money as an upsell uh, in the shipping rates that is pure profit by giving them an additional option. What I use is called insured shipping. And then I put in a description that says, get 100% insurance on your items for just $1.95 extra. It's totally worth it. So a lot of people when they're ordering items, especially during the holidays and stuff like that, they'll take this uh, because they want to make sure that they get their item. And if the parcel like USPS or whomever is shipping it loses it, that you'll replace it, right? Okay, and then uh, under here, you can add whatever that bump shipping fee would be. So you can say, I want to just literally, on top of whatever their shipping and handling fee is, add an additional $1.95 to generate, uh, you know, for them to be able to get this insured shipping rate. Now you can put in whatever you want here, right? Um, that's totally fine. And you have the option and there's more training on this, uh, to add a percentage on top of the shipping. So if you, if they have a really expensive order, like they're ordering a thousand dollar product and they want to ensure that you could say that, Hey, we want to make sure that if somebody's ordering a boatload of stuff and they want to ensure it, that, 
uh, we charge them 10% of whatever their order is. So a thousand dollar order, you know, would be really expensive to insure. That's up to you, right? You have both options here. Now, these are not done for you. So you'll need to come into settings and you'll need to name your default shipping uh, rate name and enable uh, bump shipping if you want to use it. And you can copy this here or do your own thing. All right. So coming back over to our store, I just want to show you how all of these work. Okay. So um, like I showed you earlier, in the PowerPoint, if somebody orders one item, it's $4.95 for shipping. So coming back to our shopping cart, let's see what happens if I order two plus items. Because if you recall, in our PowerPoint, we said that if somebody comes in here and buys more than one product, right, we're going to charge them $9.95 for shipping. Okay, so let's hit check out. Now you're going to see they're recalculating our shipping rates. And now you'll see that we have a shipping rate of $9.95. And with our bump shipping, it's $11.90. So that's an extra little $1.95 that you can pick up, which really adds up over time. So let's say a customer comes in and they want to buy three retail items. Well, if you recall in our shipping rules that I showed you earlier, um, we, we don't ever charge them more than $10 for shipping on retail items, okay? But what happens if somebody's buying a free product, okay? So let's come back over to our shopping cart and let's just, uh, let's delete this product altogether. And let's add a free product to the shopping cart. So um, I'm just gonna choose one of our free plus shipping products. So we'll choose like this cat necklace right here. All right, now we're gonna add this to our shopping cart and we're gonna go check out. So we charge the $10.97 fee right there for free plus shipping. So you can see here it says one free item uh, shipping special. So it's $10.97. And of course, we can bump them to the insured shipping. Now, what happens if they come in and they buy two items? Well, if they buy two items, it's going to go to $9.95 per item. So coming over here and just... And letting it fetch those shipping rates, you'll see that now it's $19.90. So now, since they have two free items, and you'll see here it says your cart's free plus shipping rate. Each free product added to your cart increases this shipping rate. And then they can choose bump shipping. Well, what happens if they come in here and they decide they want, I don't know, seven free products? All right, they hit checkout and it calculates. Now it's $69.65. One important thing here is that we're able here to notify people that each free product adds a higher shipping rate. So essentially, they could say, you know what? Uh, I may not be, want seven because that gets expensive. So let's go back down to three. So by telling them that every item in their cart that's free adds another shipping rate, we give them the knowledge to make an educa uh, educated decision to go backwards and either, you know, uh, delete some of the products from their cart so they get a better shipping rate, you know, because um, $9.95 per item, or, you know, just go ahead and, and choose this. Now, what happens if somebody comes in, and this has been the biggest problem with Shopify standard shipping rates, and even some of the other apps haven't been able to fix this. If somebody comes in here and they purchase a retail item, like they want these $60 shoes, but they have a free item in their cart as well. Typically, if somebody buys a retail product and a free product, a free plus shipping product, it confuses Shopify's basic shipping settings and it can cost you a lot of money and a lot of sales. So with Shipping Hero, let's say somebody adds this product to their shopping cart. What's going to happen is Shipping Hero is going to notice that they have a free product in their cart and they're going to default and prioritize the free plus shipping um, shipping and handling settings. Check this out. All right. So you can see here now they have the same $69.65 shipping rate because they have seven free items and now they have one free item. So what Shipping Hero does is it tells Shopify, hey, uh, prioritize the free plus shipping rate because that's where you're going to make money. Uh, without this app, what would happen is Shopify would prioritize, you know, your retail shipping rates. And so people could come in and they could get like 50 free products and then just buy one retail product and kind of uh, game the system and literally like 
it would it, it would screw everything up on my store and that's why I developed this app was to make sure that if there's a free plus shipping offer on my store it's always prioritized and that I can go in and I can come down here and I can give people other descriptions that help them identify what's going on with their shipping so I increase conversion rates. So all of this is actually already done for you. So inside the app, you're gonna have these done for you shipping rules ready to go, they're done for you. Uh, by default, I would make sure that you're running just the DFY shipping rules. Otherwise, you'll have this $100 free shipping promotion going on. Um, and you can activate these by just clicking on which one you want to activate. <laughs> Got lots of little notifications here. And then you'll also be able to come up here to help and go to video help where you can learn how to set up these rules and how to set up product specific rules that allow you to set up specific shipping rates for variants in specific products. Um, and you can see in here, you can edit any of these rules and you can see what we've done. If somebody buys two free products, nine, two or more free products, $9.95 for shipping and handling. If somebody comes in here and buys one free product, but they're from an international country, it's $11.97. Uh, if somebody comes in here and buys one free product, it's $10.97. You can see here um, how the rules are set up. So there's going to be more training um, coming into the app under the helps uh, video help section that's going to show you how all of this stuff works. But what's really cool right now is that these rules, these global rules are done for you. So unless you want to do anything different or special, these are going to work for you. These are going to do exactly what you need them to do. And of course, uh, you can go in and edit those and watch our help videos and get more information on how you can customize product specific shipping rates if you want to use them. Um, and global rules for special promotions and whatnot. So go enjoy the app. Make sure that any and all uh, other shipping rates from the basic Shopify sh shipping sections or other apps are disabled. So Shipping Hero is the only thing running um, and processing shipping rates. And get ready to crush it with this amazing app.